If you need to make a 0.5 molar solution of HCl, here's how we could do that. There are a few ways. One is we could look at a recipe. Often when you buy concentrated hydrochloric acid, there'll be a recipe included how to make different molarities, common molarities like 0.5 molar or 6 molar. This is from Flynn Scientific. Let's see their recipe online. So we have hydrochloric acid right here and we wanted to make a 0.5 molar solution. So we would need 41 milliliters in one liter to give us this 0.5 molar solution of hydrochloric acid. So you put some water in the volumetric flask, then you'd add the hydrochloric acid, 83 milliliters of it, and then you'd add more water till you got up to one liter and you'd have your one molar solution. So that's the first way to do it. Here's another way. You could use the formula M1V1 equals M2V2. If you look at the bottle of hydrochloric acid, it'll tell you that concentrated hydrochloric acid is 12 molar. And we're gonna multiply that by V1. That's how much we wanna put in our solution to get our 0.5 molar solution of NaCl. We wanna get our molarity of 0.5 molar, and we wanna make one liter of that here. So now we just divide both sides by 12 molar. We have molar on the top and bottom, that cancels out. We're gonna be left with our units of liters. So it's gonna be 0.5 divided by 12 liters. That'll be our answer. We get 0.41 liters. If you wanted milliliters, just multiply that by a thousand. That's what we had before when we looked at our recipe. So that's the other way. One final way you could do this is instead of 12 molar, maybe you had a stock solution of say three molar. So you could put your three molar in here, figure out your V1 and make your solution based on a stock solution that you maybe already made earlier. That's it, this is Dr. B looking how to make a 0.5 molar solution of HCl. Thanks for watching.